Now to a News 10 exclusive. A Stockton man wants an apology tonight for a wake-up call he should have never received. It is a story you'll only see on News 10. Lee Painter tells us why police and federal agents knocked down his door. This is what they did to my door. At 6 this morning, a SWAT team surprised Kenneth Wright at his front door. In my underwear. In my underwear. Before I get to the door, I hear him say, hit it. And I get ready to hit the door, and they hit the door. It almost hit me. So I said, hold on. They hit it again. I said, hold on. But the SWAT team busted in, taking right. They come grab me by my neck and drag me out my house to right there in the grass. Thrown to the ground and handcuffed, law enforcement then searched his house. And they put me in the back seat of a police car for over six hours. From 6 o'clock to 1230, they had me handcuffed in the back of a police car with nothing on but my ripped up underwear that they ripped in the yard. Wright says they also woke his three children, holding them for two hours. But they failed to find their quarry, Wright's estranged wife. Wright later complained to Stockton's mayor and police, but the city pointed to the U.S. Department of Education. They say you owe a student loan and you got to pay it. I just had my door kicked in because of this. With the help of the Stockton Police Department, News 10 was able to contact one of the federal agents who was at the search this morning, who gave us a Washington, D.C. number for the Office of the Inspector General, who confirmed it was the Department of Education who conducted the search, but they can't discuss anything in the case until it's closed. Not even if it's policy to break in and handcuff people who default on student loans. They put this here and they said we fixed the hole. The hole is the least of my worry. Wright says all he wants is an apology and a new door. And he has this warning to former students that the federal government's coming to collect in a big way. People that have student loans out there are people that owe money. Please pay your bills. Take care of your credit. Uh, if you don't believe me, <laughs> this could be you one morning, 6 o'clock in the morning. In Stockton, Lee Painter, News 10. Well, Stockton police say federal agents requested one patrol car for the search. They reiterated that they did not kick in Wright's door or handcuff him and said he and his children were never held.